Hello. The video that you've just watched was all about how daisies are strong and how they're resilient and they grow back even after they've been destroyed. So today I want us to think about this flower, the daisy. Now I like daisies because they always remind me of a time when I was at junior school and I used to sit on the playing fields making daisy chains with my friends. And we used to make really long daisy chains that we'd hang round our necks or put in our hair. So whenever I see a daisy, I always remember sitting on the field and sharing these happy times with my friends. But really, a lot of the time we see daisies all over the place, but we don't really take much notice of them because they're very small and they're very common, they're everywhere and they don't smell like a lot of flowers, smell lovely and you certainly wouldn't expect to find a daisy in a bouquet of flowers. In fact, a lot of people think daisies are weeds and not flowers at all. But today I want us to stop and think about these little flowers and the strength that they show. Now, these are the daisies that we kind of recognise that look quite common and boring, really. But did you know that there's actually lots of other varieties of different daisies? I've got some pictures here to show you. And these flowers here are all daisies and they're much more colourful and more beautiful. And I think any of these flowers you probably could expect to see in a lovely bouquet. So that just makes you realise that they're not all just like these ones. They can be lots of different varieties. But today we're going to think about this kind of variety, the more common variety that we see all the time. But have you ever really looked closely at a daisy? I wonder if you've ever counted how many petals a daisy has, because they do have quite a lot of petals. And the stem, if you look at the stem, is very thin and not very strong, really. And the centre is yellow and it's made up of all little pieces, all little, like little circles, really, if you look closely. And in that circle is all the seeds of the daisies, where they have lots of seeds, which is why they spread so much. Now, you never see a daisy growing alone. Usually daisies grow in clumps all together and sometimes you can see them covering a whole field and it makes the field look lovely white and yellow display. And also if you see them in the wind, it's because their stems are quite thin, they seem to like dance around in the breeze and it, and it can look quite joyful actually to see them all moving around. But we can learn quite a lot from daisies, quite a special lesson. And that's because daisies keep coming back, even when they're trodden on or picked or cut down by a lawnmower. They are very resilient and they seem to show lots of strength like you watched in the video before me. They just keep bouncing back and they refuse to be defeated. And it's like they're determined to keep smiling and to enjoy life and look joyful. Sometimes there are many circumstances in our lives that hit us and it could defeat us and knock us down. You know, perhaps we've been treated badly or we've lost someone or something that we love or we've been wrongly blamed for something or other people have perhaps laughed at us and made us feel sad. Or sometimes things at school can get on top of us. Maybe schoolwork is quite hard. And I think definitely at the moment with all the COVID-19, the rules and the regulations, it can really get us down and make us feel like there's no way out. But I think if we remember the strength 
and the resilience of the daisy, it can teach us an important lesson. And it's not sometimes circumstances or things that happen in our life that determine our mood or how we handle it, but it's our reaction to it. It's like the daisies are saying, oh, what's the point? I'll just lie down and give up, but they don't. Even though the lawnmower cuts them up or somebody picks them up, they don't give up, they bounce back. There's a saying on here, I hope you can read it. It says, we don't grow when things are easy. We grow when we face challenges. And I think this is something that we need to think about for a moment and think about how we can learn so much from this simple flower. Because sometimes we face things that are really hard. But if we react in the way, right way and bounce back and show strength, we can be stronger from that thing. And we can learn so much from it, which means we can grow and we'll grow in experience and knowledge about how to deal with things like this when they happen again. And also, if we think of the daisy that grows in clumps together and not on their own, in the same way, we need other people around us. So if you're struggling at the moment and having a really tough time, there are always people around you that you can turn to who will listen. Let us finish with a prayer. Let us pray. Dear God, thank you for all the beautiful things that you have put around us. Thank you for daisies and for all that they can teach us about being brave and joyful. Thank you that they grow together and please help us to grow together and please help us to be there for and support one another. Amen. Goodbye.